Hello, I want to explain why the position of the peak changes when you change the solvent in UV spectroscopy. So, we have uh, three energy levels, pi star, n and pi. So, this is the energy axis. So, when we use a polar solvent like we suppose our, uh, our um, sample contains this compound that alpha beta unsaturated uh, ketone uh, then we have many transitions like we have pi to pi star transitions n pi star transitions. So we have oxygen, so there are non-bonding electrons, there are pi electron. Uh, so we have these two types of probable transition. So when we use a polar solvent, so what happens is that this pi star n orbital and pi orbital, they get stabilized and as a result, their energy decreases and since we have a non-bonding pair of electron so and since in polar solvent it can undergo hydrogen bonding uh, so this n orbital is also is most stabilized and this pi is also stabilized but not as much as pi star and n so what we observe that this is the new pi star orbital n and pi so i am denoting with prime so now um, if you see this transition this energy gap has now increased and this this is one and this is two pi pi star transition is decreased as compared to this so what happens is that we can write it like this so I will keep it for reference so let me write it here the pi pi star is greater than pi prime to pi star prime and into pi star is less than n prime to pi star prime this prime is in polar solvent okay so that's why since the energy gap for uh, pi pi star has decreased so we see red sheet and since but for n pi star transition since the energy gap has increased so we have blue, uh, blue sheet that is energy is increased so that's the solvent effect so that's why the position of the peak changes when you change the polarity of the solvent thank you